As I walked through the woods, I sensed a flow of magical energy that shouldn't be there, like toxic fumes leaking from a poison jar that should have been tightly sealed. There's no mistaking it. The energy that's rising up from the bottom of the mountain behind the trees. The Great Grail that should have been destroyed. Could it be reawakening? Now that someone restarted the Holy Grail War, it's only natural that they would have ca have an eye on that cave. And if that someone is capable of restoring what we thought was safely destroyed. <laughs> I throw the- I run through the underground cavern. This is an emergency. There's no time to go back to the Emiya residence. I'll call for Saber only after I confirm the presence of this someone. Forest comes to war, so I'll use the last remaining command spell to summon her. But there's no time for hesitation. I have to stop the one that broke the infernal seal before the Great Grail comes back to life. I can see light coming out from the out of the Great Grail. However, it's still weak. No more than a damn fireplace with but one match thrown in. In that case, I should still be able to stop it. I climb up the cliff, not stopping even once. A bottomless pit created in the depths of the earth. The found of wishes that gave rise to calamity. And before this uh, abominable wreck... <laughs> oh, hey, Gil. <laughs> awesome, looking great. The guy just laughs all by himself. <laughs> it's okay. I don't know what he's up to, but it's not the kind of hazard that it could pose a problem if left alone. Oh, <laughs> How does one turn this thing on? And so I'm found out. Having run all the way here, I've got no strength left to run back. By the way, I'd like him to stop putting the weird accent on the personal part. The gold per the golden per. I mean, servant in front of me is sporting an outfit that le the likes of which I've never seen before. Nice abs. Oh, Looking good. Hot. <laughs> I mean, it's not my kind of style, personally. Thank you very much, sir. Ah, ha, ha. Comes the fresh, yet ever overbearing laughter of the King of Heroes. I see. So he got turned back rather unfortunately, so. Uh, only now do I realize what I have lost. The blonde kid was a good, a real good guy. Especially compared to this teenage punk. So, that's <laughs> He looks himself over as if looking for a stubborn piece of lint. What well, about that? Certainly there isn't anything wrong with the clothing. That's because the entire thing is wrong. As far as Western clothing go, there's no issue, small issue here. That's no small issue here. Ah, speaking of aura, the guy's all sparkling. いかにもこの姿こそ俺の正式な装束選ばれたものにしか許されない数少ない一品ものだ本編ではさすがに恥ずかしいのでボツという呪いによってお蔵入りになったが断じて恥ずべきものではない。Huh. The King of Heroes laughs anxiously yet boldly. Goes without saying that his definition of unique is rather skewed. 
見聞録というやつだ俺はこの世のすべてを手中にした男その俺に知らぬ土地などあっては世が迷うよって足を運んだこのような地の底など趣味ではないがこれも王の務めゆえな Having said that, the King of Heroes seems to be in great delight. High places, gigantic structures, and things like that must be fundamentally appealing to him. Despite being a boss character and all. そのあたりセイバーは分かっておらぬ。我が軍門に下った暁には、黄金の湯船にでも浸からせてやろう。ところで雑種、貴様、珍しいものを持っているな。え、something uncommon。いや、見ての通り手ぶらだけど。忘れているだけの話だ。それが貴様のものであることに変わりはない。あまり価値はなさそうだが、よい、健常を許すぞ。なんであれ。I just got the feeling that something important has been snatched away. ちょっと待て、何しやがった。所有権を俺に移した。うん、どうやら何かの遊戯のようだな。待つがよい、少しばかりわかりやすくしてやる。出店のわからぬ鑑定は久しぶりだ。俺にも楽しませろ。Closing his eyes, Gilgamesh looks to be in deep thought. And then, after a few minutes, I see. He laughs with satisfaction, reaches behind his back, and pulls a card out of nowhere. Is this your card? こんなところか。意味を持ってしまえばつまらぬものだったな。Oh my god, it's fucking Tiger. <laughs> だが、褒美だ持っていくがいいなんか怪しいカプセルだけどくれるのか褒美だと言ったろう。俺はオリジナルさえあればよい。その後に派生し、ルテンしていった完成品は、属性に伝わるべきものだからな。A remark worthy of a conceited monarch. Having expanded his collection, the king of heroes from the ancient earth. 観光を再開するか。下はどうなっているのか。Nothing that should concern you anymore. I almost felt a lot of rash remarks slip out. おい、そっちは危ないぞ。中には降りるな。<笑>何を言う。ただのクレーターではないか。<笑>何やらところどころに泥がこびりついているが、まあよし。止めるな、止めるな。中心に何やら面白そうなものがあるではないか。Unconcerned with danger, the proud king presses on. But little does he know, for that is the former stronghold of the thing he had carelessly let himself get swallowed by in the past. He told me not to stop you. That's not a premonition, and that's more of a reenactment. Despite starting over as a child, the same thing happens. Together with his great powers, the King of Heroes, it seems he's also given the fate of being raised with carelessness. Skill maxed out. <laughs> Although the chain of heaven is swinging around inside the Great Grail, one way or another, the King of Heroes' feeds remains bound. By the way, the partner he's referring to isn't me, it's the chain. Ah. I gave my warning, that is my duty. Jangle Jim, 
くれぐれもセイバーになど伝えるな<laughs> Ah, laughs the King of Heroes boldly yet again. All the while black mud below him and the chain of heaven entangled around his limbs. Looking smooth there. Other than displaying the ultimate and false courage, he's sure looking cool. So, 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 so. I love me some Gilgamesh. Capsule, thank you so much. Oh, I'll tell you one more thing. That's the next one. There's another one in this world. One capsule has a capsule. When I met that one, I feel like I'm going to be a soul. That one is waiting for the king of the king. その the time I took the capsule, the battle was made for the king of 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 the king. Okay, buddy. This is a final cool warning. Given to my back, I leave the great cave. Alright then. The way it looks, he should be able to uh, hold out for a year. Let alone a day. When I get a chance, I'll just let Lancer know that there's a kid in need of a rescue. <laughs> The time has come. Somewhere in the world, a distant rival awaits you. Go on today. I want to see anything special. Any new wallpapers? No. No Emmas? Yes. Oh, hey, Archer. Archer, the the so then I stew more, what I should have kinny Tiruma. Mm, so Gengatan to Yaka. Hey, then to Machini Tatsu, so no Amarino keep putting your sorrow in a stick, you could scoot that. That's all, yeah? Yeah, he would look kind of weird. What I see, what kinny Tiruma. No one cares, Archer. Oh, hey, Gilgamesh. Okay, Gilgamet or Chisa Gilgamet.落としたのはどっち黄色銀も大も小も、とにかく遠慮する。小切る金は割と好評なんだけどな。原画担当によると、旧私服右は、メイト本編で、キモイぶっちゃけありえないと没になったデザインを大復活。小切るはその流れを組
Even if that's an exaggeration, I can't fathom how tiresome that must be. I feel sorry for him. Doesn't look like the kind of guy that dislikes drinking. Should I take some from the main temple building? <laughs> Suddenly Koijiro stands up. Behind me I hear somebody going up the stone steps. Out of breath, I make frequent stops along the way. Wondering who that might be, I hide behind the gate and take a peek. Huh? Koijiro aside, there was no uh, no need for me to hide, I just followed along. As she's having a rest just a few steps before the top, I see a familiar face. Saigusa. Is she alone? Once recovered, she slowly conquers the last bed. <laughs> the garden question, Koijiro gazes at Sasuke, uh, Saigusa silently. Her epic is sent finally over, she looks at him uneasily, not noticing him yet. But she sees Koijiro. I do recall hearing about this uh, somewhere. She speaks up, a hint of fear in her voice. One well, can't blame her. No when the anachronism of a swordsman stands in front of her. No single TV crew or signboard in sight. Great talk. It probably is. A very psychosa like straight pitch. She must be inquiring about Koijiro's antique looking clothes. Oh my god. What kind of history, I wonder? Psychosa ponders, tilting her head to the side. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. Wait. You've seen her? She seems a little... Uh, a little off-put by his blunt manner of speech. Perhaps it's about time to interrupt them. Just as I'm about to make an appearance, I guess his unexpectedly persistent stand stops me in my tracks. The things are the way things are going now, this is not a good time to come out. Toshida. Stop making up weird names. Do you think she might get suspicious if he called himself Sasaki Koidru while wearing that outfit? Yeah, probably. Kimi-no-name-wa? <laughs> You're a wicked man, Koidro. However, I can sympathize. Being perpetually assigned to guard duty while caster strolls freely around town would put anyone in a foul mood. Muttering thus, he sits down on the stone steps. She really is, though she wouldn't notice it herself. But despite her nervousness, she still sits down beside him. Leave me alone. Probably. While saying that, Saigusa runs her hands all over Koijiro's costume. While his face may remain stone still, he is definitely troubled. Maki-chan and Kane-chan are not in the 
時が悪かったのだろう。He mutters in bewilderment, staying with the cider. The friend advised cute little puppy, even Koijuru finds it hard to be unkind. He isn't exactly lying, but he isn't quite telling the truth either. Of course, he'd be reluctant to talk about servants and so forth in the first place. あ、それだから、お侍さんみたいな格好してるんですか私、秋のお祭りの出し物の稽古をしてるのかなって思ってたんです。いや、that's <coughs> No. Hearing that it's a real sword, Saigusa leads back. No wonder when you think about it, seeing a man armed with a real sword right in front of you is a bit of a shock. Even my thick head itself would be perturbed in that situation. No, you wouldn't be. You'd want to see it. <laughs> oh, be it now. Temukawa no onna kodomo wa kiri wa senu. Demo, kesat toka daishobu nan desu ka? Totally. Jisha wa moto yori. Shugo funyu no chida. Shinpai wa nai. I have not talked to the police, but it is fine. What century is that from? Gathering her resolve once again, Sagasa timidly goes back to sitting by his side. <laughs> the flow of the conversation is interrupted, and silence sets in, yet there is definitely a friendly air between the two of them. As I watch from behind the gate, I suddenly feel rather embarrassed by this act of voyeurism. <laughs> Listening to this makes me nervous. I mean, Taiga says talking to a guy out of her own will. Just what is it that attracts her to Koijuro? Is this slightly greater than average audacity? Had Makidera been here, there'd be more than a violent uproar, no doubt. No, thank you. Koijuro is nodding, but his face remains stern. Koijuro He lets out a light sigh. His dramatic attitude looks nothing more than an attempt to relieve some boredom at the expense of Saigusa's naivete. She seems dejected. It would seem like Makidera or Tosaka to, it would take someone like Makidera or Tosaka to extract a promise as overbearing as that. ユキカ殿。それでしたら今度私の弟たちに会っていただけませんか Having said that much, she stays silent. Not that it makes any less it any less forceful. Hearing promise, the word causes her anxiety. A faint smile appears on Koidru's face. There's no way Saigusa would know the weight of the promise that binds his body here. Yuki 
そうか姉上に似て兄弟思いの優しい弟もなのであろう The praise causes Saigus's、like, cheek to light up bright red in an instant. She's flustered once again. So, no, 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 赤実を思い出すのも悪くはないと思うてな。Nothing like that. Koijiro is getting dramatic again. Twisted as he is, he can still weave in a gla glamorous quote. Or did he actually mean it? If that's the case, I have greatly underestimated Saigus's skill. 本当ですか気が向けば顔程度は見せよう。とはいえ、夜の訪問は物騒だ。日中であればいつかの機会にじゃじゃあまた日を改めて弟たちと一緒に来ますからすいませんこんなことをお願いして She bows deeply In the end despite wanting to leave I guess it's alright So I really did end up just watching them Koijiru knew it, but it's rather rude for me to be peeking on, on Saigusa. As quickly as possible, I take my leave. Nobody's here at the corner of the pier. I'm pretty sure this was Shinji's spot. What's up with that? The weather was so nice just now, yet the sky is suddenly getting covered in dark clouds. No. I can't turn back now. If it really is a storm coming, I should warn him. Hi, Shinji! Iruka! And so the wind has gone beyond just strong. No matter how you look at it, this is not natural. The moment I'm at the harbor, a big storm comes. Pretty much a cataclysm. Oh my god. He really had the other card? Jesus. <laughs> 